backyard blowing out leaves of this customer of mine. And I turn around and here's Roscoe on the walker. Kind of surprised me. I've never seen him on this walker, but uh, he wanted to get on it and try it out for the first time. And after he got done picking up this big pile, he uh, backed up the whole yard. And I look back, he had really straight lines. He did really, really well. I'm not too sure what he thinks about it. I know they're not his cup of tea, but uh, I think he had some fun on it. Uh, I'm not so sure that he'll admit that, but uh, I think he had fun on it. And he did very, very good. I was really impressed. It is Tuesday morning, and it is really nice out. It's like 48 degrees already. It's supposed to get up like 51, 52 today. Very light breeze. We got a few left to knock out. I have like six or seven left to do. Uh, two of them are just quick little half cleanups, so to speak. Um, but one of them I have to do is one I did for another guy last year. And I did it January 7th. I just looked on my phone through my videos. It was called Leaf Cleanup with Walker Mower. And the thumbnail said, freezing cold and did I blow it up? That's one where I thought I blew up the walker. But uh, I did that one January 7th and the leaves were half frozen to the ground. It was just, it wasn't hard, um, but some parts of it were a pain in the butt because he hadn't mowed it and he didn't mow like the last month of the season. So it was long plus a lot of leaves. I got that one to do day two. He told me early this year. So I'm gonna get that one knocked out today while it's still not. This is my neighbor's backyard and it's the three yards. Mine is the one the camera's sitting in, then my neighbor's, then the neighbor next to that one and I blow the leaves out of all three of the backyards all the way to the back and in previous years I've done this with Ryan's leaf plow I've done it with the little wonder I've done it with everything but you can see the sheer volume of leaves here and this is the fifth time I've done it since leaves started falling and there's been this amount or more every single time that's how many leaves we get back here so this machine has just made a world of difference this year. It's been out of control the time that it has saved me just on these three properties alone. It's just a massive amount of leaves. And when you have a lot of leaves, a lot of big bulk leaves, it's the way to go. Like I said, we've attacked it with two little wonders. We've done it with the biggest backpack blowers. We've done it with everything. Nothing compares to what this thing can do. And here's Billy. He uh, was home from school, and I asked him to give me a hand with these three yards. He was more than happy to. Uh, this is the first time he really got to play in leaves, any bulk amount of leaves anyway. And uh, then I stopped right here and asked him, you know, hey, you want to hop on this thing? You want to try it out? And he was more than happy to get on it and uh, give it a try. So uh, you'll see me right about here. I, I asked him, you want on this thing? And uh, it, it didn't take him even a second to... Uh, to the side yep that's for me so he did really really well on it he uh he went really slow at first no big deal um it's a new piece of equipment and you gotta learn the controls first this thing is really snappy and it, it'll turn really fast on you gotta pay attention so i was kind of showing him the controls um you know as far as controlling the baffles because if you're moving big bulk leaves you gotta aim high but if you're trying to clear the ground you gotta aim it low After we got done with this, Billy 
did a little interview type deal in my garage and I asked him what he thought of this and he really loved it. He said it was far better than trying to push all those leaves with a backpack blower. He was a big fan of this, but for some reason it, uh, it didn't let me upload that footage to my computer. My computer's been really weird lately. My GoPro's been really weird. I've done the updates on it. Everything's been back and forth and screwy. I've tried swapping SD cards to a new style card and one minute I'll be uploading footage and it'll be uploading at like 47 to 54 megabytes per second. And then the next day I'll go to upload and it'll upload at like 2.73 megabytes uh, per second. And it just takes forever to upload footage. But anyway, he was a big fan of this machine and he definitely liked it a lot.